Hello football fans, in this video I'm going to compare Kevin De Bruyne versus Thomas Muller versus Marco Royce. I'm going to compare their club careers, their national careers, their discipline on the pitch, their penalty records, awards that they have received and trophies that they have won with their teams. But before that, let us take a look at some of their basic information. De Bruyne's full name is Kevin De Bruyne. Muller's full name is Thomas Muller. Poirot's full name is Marco Royce. Kevin De Bruyne was born on 28th June 1991. He's 31 years old. Thomas Muller was born on 13th September 1989. He's 33 years old. Paul Marco Royce was born on 31st May 1989. He's 33 years old. Kevin De Bruyne was born in Belgium. Thomas Muller was born in West Germany. Paul Marco Royce was born in West Germany as well. Kevin De Bruyne is 1.81 meters or 5 feet 11 inches tall. Thomas Muller is 1.85 meters or 6 feet 1 inch tall. Paul Marco Royce is 1.80 meters or 5 feet 11 inches tall. Kevin De Bruyne's current market value is 80 million euros. For Thomas Muller is 18 million euros. While for Marco Royce is 9 million euros. Kevin De Bruyne's weekly salary at Manchester City is for 50,000 euros. For Thomas Muller is 395,000 euros. While for Marco Royce is 211,000 euros. Okay, let us now compare their club careers. Kevin De Bruyne has played for Genk, Vata Bremen, Chelsea, Wolfsburg and Manchester City. Thomas Muller has played for Bayern Munich. Paul Marco Royce has played for Rot Base Ahlen, Borussia Mönchengladbach and Borussia Dortmund. Kevin De Bruyne has played 576 games. Thomas Muller has played 659 games. Paul Marco Royce has played 534 games. Kevin De Bruyne has scored 140 goals. Thomas Muller has scored 234 goals. Paul Marco Royce has scored 207 goals. Kevin De Bruyne has provided 230 assists. Thomas Muller has provided 255 assists. Paul Marco Royce has provided 152 assists. So Kevin De Bruyne has recorded 0.64 goal contributions per game. Thomas Muller has 0.74. Paul Marco Royce has 0.67. Okay, let us now compare their international careers. Kevin De Bruyne represents Belgium national team. Muller represents Germany national team. Paul Marco Royce represents Germany national team as well. Kevin De Bruyne has played 99 games. Thomas Muller has played 121 games. Paul Marco Royce has played 48 games. Kevin De Bruyne has scored 26 goals. Thomas Muller has scored 44 goals. Paul Marco Royce has scored 15 goals. Kevin De Bruyne has provided 48 assists. Thomas Muller has provided 40 assists. Paul Marco Royce has provided 14 assists. So Kevin De Bruyne has 0.75 goal contributions per game. Thomas Muller has 0.69. Paul Marco Royce has 0.60. Okay, let us now compare their total career statistics for both club and country in all competitions. Kevin De Bruyne has played a total of 675 games in his entire football career. Thomas Muller has played 780 games. Paul Marco Royce has played 582 games. Kevin De Bruyne has scored 166 goals. Thomas Muller has scored 278 goals. Paul Marco Royce has scored 222 goals. Kevin De Bruyne has provided 278 assists. Thomas Muller has provided 295 assists. Paul Marco Royce has provided 166 assists. So Kevin De Bruyne has 0.66 goal contributions per game. Thomas Muller has 0.73. Paul Marco Royce has 0.66. Okay, let us now compare their discipline on the football pitch. Kevin De Bruyne has received 57 yellow cards. Thomas Muller has received 41 yellow cards. Paul Marco Royce has received 59 yellow cards. Kevin De Bruyne has received 2 red cards. Thomas Muller 0 red cards. And Marco Royce 2 red cards. Okay, now it's time to compare their penalty records. 
Kevin De Bruyne has taken 11 penalties. Thomas Muller has taken 38. Paul McElroy has taken 23. Kevin De Bruyne has scored 9. Thomas Muller 30. And McElroy 18. So Kevin De Bruyne has a penalty conversion rate of 82%. Thomas Muller has a 29%. Paul McElroy has a 78%. Okay, let us now compare the awards that they have received. Kevin De Bruyne has received 55 awards. That includes two times IWFHS World Best Playmaker, two times Premier League Playmaker of the Season, and two times Premier League Player of the Season. Thomas Muller has received 30 awards, and that includes FIFA World Cup Golden Boot 2010, four times Bundesliga Team of the Season, and one time UCL Squad of the Season. Paul McElroy's has received 27 awards and that includes three times Bundesliga player of the season, one time UCL squad of the season, and six times Bundesliga team of the season. Okay, let us now compare the trophies that they have won. Kevin De Bruyne has won 16 trophies, that is four EPL trophies, one FA Cup, one German Cup, five League Cups, one German Super Cup, two Community Sheets, one Belgian Pro League, and one Belgian Cup. Thomas Muller has won that two trophies, that is 2014 FIFA World Cup, two UCL titles, two FIFA Club World Cups, 11 Bundesligas, two UEFA Super Cups, six German Cups, and eight German Super Cups. Holmar Koroiz has won five trophies, that is two German Cups and three German Super Cups. Alright guys, there you have it. Which of these three players do you think is the best and which one is your favorite? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching Factual Animations on YouTube. Please subscribe for more amazing content like this. Also like this video and comment down below. Cheers!